watching the 33 News at 9. This is the season of giving, but the slumping economy is taking its toll on Christmas charities. Donations decline while applications soar. The Cowboy Santa program in Fort Worth is struggling to find enough toys for hundreds of children in need. More tonight from the 33's Dan X McGraw. Lines stretched around the Cowboy Santa Depot. These days, the lines are a little longer, and the stories are very similar. Out of work because of the recession. I was ready to quit school because I was going to have to find another job to get presents for the kids. Renee Hernandez lost her job at a construction company because of the stumbling economy. She worried her four children wouldn't be able to celebrate Christmas this year. But I can honestly say if it weren't for this, there would be nothing under my tree, nothing at all. And I'm blessed because a lot of places weren't taking any more applicants for anything. And I just happened to stumble onto the right one that was. The program serves families that are 150% below the poverty line, and all the children receive at least six gifts. This year, organizers are expecting to see more than 13,000 families, a thousand more than last year. And the increase is leaving organizers searching for toys. It's been a little tougher this year, but uh, uh, we've got... Uh, We've got a lot of hope here. While some choose to donate toys, others are that. giving their time. We'll get this one, Sky Dancer. Lindsay McLaughlin helped gather toys for children today. She says it gives her a new viewpoint on Christmas. Makes me feel like I'm kind of spoiled a little bit because we don't have to worry about stuff like that. And for these kids just to get a few little you know, a handful of toys will make their Christmas. The program will be handing out its final gifts on Tuesday. In Fort Worth, Dan X. McGraw, The 33 News. If you would like to donate toys or money to the Cowboy Santa program, you can do so by visiting our website at the33tv.com.